Hi everyone, this is Grace. I hope you've been well. Um, this is my Dollar Tree haul for um, this week. I was hoping actually that things would slow down in the summer months and um, I realize it hasn't. <laughs> so anyway, um, luckily I was able to get, what, 10, 20 minutes? Um, take a 10, 20 minute break after work and swing by and there were two things on my wish list and I was able to find both of them and I knew I mean you guys know those of you who do but Dollar Tree hauls um, that if you wait too long after the new items have come in they're just not going to be there so um, this one actually is the Polaroid um, premium white mailing labels and um, I just thought that these would be great just to print out a whole bunch of my addresses certainly, especially as I get ready um, in December to mail out a lot of Christmas cards and such. It's just always nice to have my ready-made mailing um, address labels instead of having to write you know, my address again and again repeat repetitively. Um, and then these are the chalk markers that everyone has been talking about or at least those who found them in the Dollar Tree. This is by the company Jot, and um, there are four, as far as I can tell, yellow, um, and they're pastel, yellow, blue, pink, and white. And um, I had purchased one, no, actually two. One was a um, lavender purple, and then the other one was like a pastel pink, or a neon pink from Daiso for $1.50. But, you know, this is, what, 50 cents cheaper, and I thought, you know what, why not give it a try? And it's the markers that, you know, once they dry, they are like chalk, so. Now, there were these Scotch Expressions washi tape, and I do like my washi tape, so I ended up getting these. And then I found this one, which I normally wouldn't have, but if you actually look at the way the nail could look, I thought, mm, it might be fun just to have as a little, um, it's this is called Starry Night, and I'm like, I'm not seeing the night aspect, but the starry with all the glitter I can see. Anyway, there are 40 gel strips, and I just thought that these would be fun once my um, summer term is over. I have like, what, one week break between summer term and fall term, and I thought it would be fun just to try out. Otherwise, I can always give it to um, someone as a gift. These are the 40 strips, and this one is after midnight, so. I just thought that these were um, pretty designs that weren't so far out there that people couldn't use. Anyway, you'll see the little um, orange kitty cat um, hand towel. This is going to um, a little birthday package that I'm preparing for a friend. These are my little pop-up turtles and for those of you who don't know I'm actually considered the turtle of the family and so whenever there are little turtle things I like to collect them from time to time and then minions are near and dear to my heart for a number of reasons and so when there was this little sticker book I thought that I would get it and take a look isn't she adorable with her little unicorn anyway so I ended up getting that now I actually had the two things that I told you I was actually on the lookout for actually were two, three things. So um, that was one of them. And then the chalks were the second. And then these were the third items. So take a look. They're actually pretty big. I would say they're a good, what, it almost looks like a regular um, page, like eight and a half by 11, but it's definitely a little bit narrower, maybe eight inches or seven and a half. And it's a chalkboard um, sticker, so it's an autocollant, but I am actually, oh, it's not a wall decal, it's actually a sticker. It's okay, no problem, I can make do. So I'm hoping to um, stick these in various places and use them. And this one says, don't forget. That one says, to-do list, and I thought that that would be good to use. Notes, and then the reminder, I love the little tack pins and then this one is just without anything and so you can use that however and so you know it's a great way to I guess write inspirational um, quotes as like a pick-me-up at the beginning of the day or at the end of a day 
certainly you can use this as a um, checklist of things that you need to do and so don't forget to do XYZ or maybe even a quote hey don't forget that you make your own like positive whatever or, you know all those great inspirational quotes sorry I'm tired <laughs> So anyway, yeah, and then there's the to-do list and a whole number of things. So I just thought that these were great. I had started to watch people haul them. And so, yeah, um, if I follow you and you notice that I haven't been around commenting and such, I do apologize. I just haven't been watching a whole lot of YouTube videos um, as much as I would like because... Um, for the summer months, I didn't realize it was going to take such a toll on my um, schedule, but I teach a 7.30 in the morning class, which has me leaving home at around 6.45 in the morning. That wouldn't be a problem, usually, if I can come home earlier in the day, but I also agree to teach a later afternoon class, which then has me teaching um, all the way up until about 6 p.m., so by the time I get home, it's about seven and I've been outside for about 12 hours and um, it, it definitely makes a difference. One hour of sleep um, that you're not used to and then just the fact that schedule is as busy as usual and then some. So it's definitely been throwing me off. So anyway, long story short, um, I don't know how regular these videos will be because last week was my first full week at, um, of my summer schedule so we'll see how things go but hopefully I'll be able to swing by from time to time and post a little haul video for you guys to watch and kind of you know keep an eye out for what's coming in your stores um, and I don't know about you guys but I really do um, appreciate when I do watch Dollar Tree hauls Th I mean that's one of the reasons why I watch them is to just kind of see what's what might be coming to my um, Dollar Tree as well as perhaps um, gain some ideas because some of you guys out there have some really great ideas on how to use these products and so um, yeah anyway I think that's it so I wish you all goodbye and of course there's no Bentley today because Bentley apparently it's too hot in Southern California and so Bentley's in the um, hallway resting <laughs> against the marble <laughs> Anyway, all right, that's it, everyone. Have a great week, and hopefully I can get this uploaded on Monday. So, all right, take care. Bye.